More now on the news that the actor Sean Connery has died, known, of course, as one of the great James Bonds, known and loved right around the world. David Silito looks back at his life. Bond. James Bond. I'll just go and put some clothes on. I don't go to any trouble on my account. I'm all yours. Cary Grant, David Niven, many great actors were considered, but when the producers met Sean Connery, they knew they'd found James Bond. Looking for shells? No, I'm just looking. As the suave but ruthless 007, he spent the 60s saving the world and dealing with power-crazed evil geniuses. But the sudden success Do you expect me to talk? caught him by surprise. No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die. I had no um, awareness of uh, that scale of kind of reverence and pressure and what have you. I never had a press representative or anything, and uh, I found it um, a bit of a nightmare. It was bodybuilding in a Mr. Universe contest that helped lead to some early acting work, but it was far from overnight success. He had many jobs. Milkman, lifeguard, model, coffin polisher. One of his first film roles was in a Disney musical. I love the ground she walks upon, my darling Irish girl. And while he made powerful films such as The Hill during his Bond years, I'm a regular soldier because I couldn't get a bloody job in Civic Street. He was glad to move on from 007. There were successes. We've been all over India. We know her cities, her jungles, her jails, and her palaces. And we have decided that she isn't big enough for such as we. But Bond cast a long shadow. The 80s, though, saw a revival of his box office power. He won an Oscar for The Untouchables. Want to get Capone? Here's how you get him. He pulls a knife, you pull a gun. He sends one of yours to the hospital, you send one of his to the morgue. That's the Chicago way. And that's how you get Capone. I suddenly remembered my Charlemagne. Let my armies be the rocks and the trees and the birds in the sky. Indiana Jones, The Hunt for Red October. He was a true Hollywood star with a home in Spain, but always a Scot and a high-profile supporter of the SNP. Tell me, Miss Trench, do you play any other games? And while he proved I there mean, was life after Bond, it was the role that made him a star and the one to which everyone else would always have to be measured. My name is Pussy Galore. I must be dreaming. See the headlines as they happen and watch BBC News live in the app and get the full story with bbc.co.uk forward slash news. Follow the story for all the latest with BBC News.